Reason number three, what Flowfuse adds to standard Node-RED. Flowfuse allows you to create snapshots of your Node-RED instances. Creating snapshots is really helpful if you want to have a copy of your Node-RED instance that you've pushed into production, or if you want to revert back to a flow that has been changed in development. In standard Node-RED, to, to create a snapshot, you would actually need to export the flow in, into the file system to create a copy. This isn't really a great way to create reliable snapshots. Let's look at how Flowfuse adds snapshots to your Node-RED development. Here you can see the application view that I'm working on. I want to open up the demo application in, in Node-RED and, and do some work on it. So this is my demo application that I have. It's pretty simple, two flows um, with using the range node to convert um, numbers. The first flow is miles or kilometers. The second one is scaling down a number by a factor of 10. Pretty simple, but for demonstration purposes, I want to create a snapshot of these flows. So I can go back to, to the application view, and then I'm going to open up this instance. This actually view shows me all the information about this instance. It also actually has a tab called Snapshots. So I can go to the Snapshots, and now I'm going to create a snapshot of this Node-RED instance, the demo application. I'm going to create it, called version 1. I'm going to add a description. For now, I'm not going to. And there. Now I've created a version of that Node-RED instance. So I'm going to go back to this instance and actually do some work on it. And what I want to do is actually just use one inject node here. So I'm going to delete this inject node. I'm going to wire up it to the same inject node to multiple flows, um, deploy the flow, and then run it. And you can see it works. Now let's say I want to actually revert back to the previous version of this of these flows. So I can come back to the snapshot view, and there's a feature called rollback. So I'll select rollback. What rollback will do is basically bring back the previous instance that I had into my Node-RED editor. So re essentially what I'm recreating the entire environment that I had um, beforehand. So the instance gets reloaded into Node-RED, and you can see now I'm back to having two inject nodes. So I can actually create as many version snapshots I want of this flow and create a complete version history. So snapshots are a really useful feature that allow you to create a version history of any Node-RED development. It allows for a more reliable and reproducible software development using Node-RED. We hope you agree.